In this video, we'll be taking a look at one NFL game happening on November 16, 2023, and providing you with a free team pick and total pick for this game. So two picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on this one NFL game after fully watching Watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Cincinnati Bengals vs. Baltimore Ravens The American Football Conference North is currently locked in a riveting race, and the impending clash between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Baltimore Ravens on Thursday night has the potential to escalate the tension in this closely contested division. Cincinnati is coming off a heart-wrenching 30-27 loss against the Texans, halting a four-game losing streak that had seemingly cast them aside. Similarly, the Ravens witnessed their own four-game slump come to an end in a nail-biting 33-31 loss to the Browns. Weather conditions are anticipated to be favorable, with temperatures expected to hover in the upper 40 seconds under clear skies at Bank Stadium in Baltimore. The Bengals, once deemed virtually out of contention after a challenging 1-3 start, made a commendable resurgence with four consecutive wins before hitting a stumbling block last week. Their clash with the Texans saw the Cincinnati defense conceding a staggering 544 total yards and allowing 28 first downs. Statistically, they ranked third worst in yards allowed this season, with an average of 384 total yards against them per game. Despite this, the Bengals' defense has showcased resilience, allowing 21.3 points per game and excelling in turnover creation, tying for second with an impressive 12 interceptions. Key contributors like Cam Taylor Britt and Logan Wilson have stood out, with Taylor Britt expected to overcome a finger injury and take the field on Thursday. On the offensive front, Cincinnati has demonstrated firepower, averaging 26.6 points per game over their last five outings and 20.2 per game for the season. Even in their loss to Houston, the Bengals managed to amass 380 total yards, maintaining an average of 301.7 yards per game this season, ranking 22nd in the NFL. Quarterback Joe Burrow continued his impressive form with his second consecutive 300-plus yard passing game throwing for 347 yards on 27 minutes 40 passing. While Burrow threw for at least two touchdowns for the fifth straight game, he also experienced a season-high two interceptions and four sacks. Notably, the Bengals boast the best turnover differential in the league, tied with the Steelers at plus 10. The Ravens currently sit atop the tightly packed American Football Conference North, with two teams hot on their heels at 7-3 and the Bengals closing in with a 5 minutes 4 record. Despite their offensive prowess, the Ravens faced a late-game collapse against the Browns, conceding 16 points in the fourth quarter and succumbing to a last-second game-winning field goal. With an offense averaging 362.7 yards per game, ranking ninth in the NFL, and scoring 27 points per game, Baltimore is a formidable force. Quarterback Lamar Jackson threw for 223 yards and ran for 41 in the last game, although he also registered a season-high two interceptions. Jackson, with 2,177 passing yards, ranks 14th in the NFL and is second on the team with 481 rushing yards. On the defensive end, the Ravens showcased dominance, allowing only 273.6 yards per game, the second best in the league, and boasting the best overall points per game record at 15.7. Their pass defense ranks fourth, allowing an average of 173.1 yards per game, and they have been formidable in limiting passing touchdowns, having allowed only seven. Additionally, their impressive interception count of 10 ties them for the fourth most in the NFL, with safety Geno Stone leading the league with six interceptions. This primetime divisional showdown promises to be captivating, with both the Bengals and Ravens coming off games where substantial leads slipped away. The question looms large, which team can rebound from adversity. Both squads are entering the matchup on the heels of hard-fought contests that culminated in last-second field goals, and the previous encounter between these teams ended with a slim three-point margin of victory. Opting to take the point seems prudent, especially considering Cincinnati's determination to avenge their earlier loss to Baltimore and the disparity in turnover differentials. Cincinnati's remarkable plus-10 differential is tied for the best in the league, a crucial factor in a projected closely contested game. In contrast, the Ravens hold a modest plus-one differential and struggled to ignite their ground game in the previous week. 
The Bengals, accustomed to facing Lamar Jackson, are poised to curtail his rushing effectiveness. Meanwhile, Burrow's recent stellar performances make Cincinnati a formidable opponent. Revisiting their earlier matchup this season, the Ravens secured a 27-24 victory in Cincinnati as plus three underdogs. While Baltimore maintains a 6-4 straight-up record in the last 10 meetings, the Bengals boast a 4-5-1 against the spread record in that stretch. Recent trends indicate that the Ravens are 6-4 against the spread this season, but one one to two against the spread in their last three games, while the Bengals are four to four to one against the spread this year, with an impressive four to one against the spread record in their last five games. Despite Burrow's two interceptions in the previous game, his exceptional performance over the last five games, averaging 296 passing yards with 12 touchdowns, adds to Cincinnati's strength. On the other hand, Jackson, while not as efficient, has managed to contribute effectively. The outcome is unpredictable, but the odds seem to favor Cincinnati if they can secure the turnover battle, especially given their dire need for a win. Cincinnati boasts a 2-0 against the spread record in their last two road games. In essence, this matchup carries immense significance in the standings, fueled by the intensity of a long-standing rivalry and the added pressure of a short week. Opting for the points, particularly considering Cincinnati's recent success against the Ravens, appears strategic. The anticipation surrounding this matchup extends beyond its impact on the standings, fueled by the long-standing rivalry and amplified by the constraints of a short week, make the team getting a field goal very enticing. So the Cincinnati Bengals to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. Shifting focus to the total, the projected total is just half a point higher than their meeting in September, where they combined for 51 points. Despite setbacks last weekend, both teams have showcased offensive prowess. Cincinnati has scored at least 24 points in their last three games, while Baltimore has consistently put up at least 31 points in each of their last four games. Recent trends reveal a propensity for high-scoring affairs between these rivals, with two of the last three Bengals games going over and three of the last four Ravens games surpassing the total. The Ravens, scoring 31 points or more in four straight games, combined with the resurgence of the Bengals' offense, led by a healthy burrow, suggests both teams will exploit defensive vulnerabilities. While both teams possess an intimate understanding of each other's playstyle, injuries on the defensive side create ample opportunities for two high-octane offenses to find the end zone. Even though the prevailing trend in standalone games this year leans towards the under, with a staggering 25-7 record in favor of the under in primetime games, it's imperative to trust the recent offensive trends and performances. The offenses of both teams are trending in the right direction, and they should be well prepared to showcase their ability to put up points. The offenses of both teams are trending positively, and they are likely to capitalize on defensive vulnerabilities. Despite the prevailing trend favoring the under, and as challenging as it may be, over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.